Hello guys, Flying Dutchy here and welcome back to German Reich in our naval challenge here <clears throat> where we will try to build a big navy. Now, we are going really slow at the moment. We don't have that many uh, dockyards. We have, what is it? 18 working on it right now. Are we repairing something? Yeah, we are actually repairing some ships because we are training them and I think I have to get the re repair queue a bit more, uh, bigger here. Yeah, they are not training at the moment, but we need way more ships if we want to beat um, the British. But that's the problem. We need anything else as well. We need more troops. We need more tanks. We need more civilian factories. We need more military factories. But I really think we have to keep making more of these, otherwise our challenge will be failing. So I'm going to put these on top. With this one here and I will build all of these uh, naval factories first. Uh, one thing we can do after we got the naval rearmament here. I mean we get more dockyards here as well. But there is this uh, Reichsautobahn into the German war economy which will help us immensely. So I think I will do these two first so we get full uh, infrastructure in four states and we get uh, the war economy law. And we get six more military factories, actually. Uh, you can also go this way when you align Romania and Hungary and then integrate them, make them become part of your Axis faction. And I think you will puppet them at some point. I think you can puppet them this way. But uh, since we are not playing on, uh, um, on uh, historical focuses, I'm not going to go this way. I will go these two instead of these three. Yeah, I think we're going to do these two afterwards and then maybe go back to the Navy. Uh, another thing I was considering, maybe we should just go and fabricate a, a war. I mean, if I go to war with Poland right now, I will also be at war with Romania. Now, I don't know if I am going to get uh, the oil of Romania. Because I think you need to conquer his land before uh, you peace out. Otherwise, you cannot take any land from him. Because they have a lot of oil. There's 70 oil in Romania that I can just take right now. Because I don't think when we are doing this... It takes a long time. But uh, the world tension is not high enough that the allies are going to protect them. On the other hand, maybe Poland is going to form his own faction. What is he going to do here? Poland first? Hmm... What is he doing? Is he making his own faction? How can I see this? Wait, 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 wait. Manpower? No. I don't know. Treaty? Here, he needs to go this way. Then he creates his faction. And then no one can help him. But I don't know if he's going that way. And uh, what are you doing? Yeah, he is making uh, his full fortification. So we're gonna have a big problem invading the Czechoslovakians. Because they have level 7 forts everywhere. Need to do a airdrop invasion, I think. That's going to be really hard. Okay, let's uh, unpause the game. And yeah, just let keep training a bit over here. Get a bit more... No, we're not training actually. Oh, the question of Yugoslavia. German pressure or not? Yes, we'll pressure them. Um, we could use a bit more tungsten. And I will. Let's try a bit with the Swedes here. I think that's important. And yes, we are still at war here in Spain. So. Looks like we are not doing that great. So let's uh, not attack them anymore. I mean, we have a nice pocket over here. I think, yeah, I was sending another one. Uh, we can modify the government again. So we don't have to go to war economy here. Because we will get this automatically. And uh, yeah, we should get the war industrial list, I think. Let's get the war industrial list. So we build uh, our dockyards a bit quicker. Okay, there is our other tank. You can go to this army. 
over there. And we are getting locked here. Well, luckily we have some supply from uh, this dockyard. Can we win this? Maybe. I mean, they should not have supply now, right? No, they don't have supply. So we should uh, try to uh, keep the attack on over here. Oh, and we have research slots. So what are we going to do? It's too early. Uh, yeah, you are still working on that one. We need to complete all of these focuses. Uh, smoke generators, meh. Too early for new ships. We will wait for some uh, bonuses on this and then we take them. Could make our artillery better. I need the trade deal with the Soviets here. I don't know if I go for field hospitals. I don't think I will go for field hospitals. Nah, we will have enough manpower, I think. This one is good for our tanks, so they get a bit more reliability. And we really need that one later on our big tank units. So let's uh, research it right now. Oh, now they are connected again. Now we are cut off. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Oh, what is happening? Attack. I said attack. I said attack. Stop them. See if I can uh, help a bit over here. Okay, we have another pocket here. That's good. Oh yeah, we have enough um, army experience now that we can change something over here. Um, so I think the ideal setup over here will be engineer, support artillery, support anti-tank. Um, recon and something else. What am I missing here? I don't know. Wait a minute. Let me check this real quick. I need uh, my engineers so they have a bit of a um, well, entrenchment bonus and attack bonus over rivers and stuff. This is good for your uh, reconnaissance. Yeah, maybe field hospitals for maybe still for our inventory divisions. Engineer, recon. Field hospital. Support artillery. And anti-tank. I think that's what we are going to do. So we will get the field hospital. But also the uh, recon. And I think we will just give this one to them. Anti-air I'm not so, such a fan of because we will make planes ourselves. So we're not going to do that one. Let's get this one here. How much do we have? Okay, we don't have that enough supply equipment, but soon we will. Now we should have a deficit of, yeah, 350. Still need tons of artillery. And light tanks. That's also because we are fighting, of course. Yeah, make sure you are going to kill them over here. Uh, four units over here that can be stack wiped, so very important that we do this. And in the meantime, Heinz gets some more skill points and our field marshal. Gonna be useful later. Let's add a couple more of these in. Hard to see what they are doing. Are you retreating? No, you need to go around this one and attack this one. I mean, we do have enough fuel, so there should be no problem. Okay, there we go. Now we have spare naval factories. Let's uh, finish these ones first. 
So they still need to be built. Yeah, we are still working on our carriers and our two heavy ships here. And we will keep building this one all the time. And I think we just build a new one. And yeah, we need to get our military factories. So I will go to the German war economy. And how much people do we have? Yeah, soon we can ask it for Sudetenland. From Czechoslovakia. I think they're going to say no. Uh, but when you play non-historical, you will get it, so... Uh, did you guys do anything there? I don't think so. Uh, go here. Try to go there. And kill that pocket. And then we have to help over here. Because this will become part of a different faction. But at least we get our army experience this way. That's good. Some more pockets are getting made. They are leaving that province, so I will take it. Yeah, we still have the Mayville bills in four days, but um, it only costs us 0.2 because we annexed um, uh, Austria. Yeah, we are losing light techs. Don't have enough factories. Uh, I think I need to continue the radar because I want this one. For the... Um, asymmetric radar here. For more service detection. Which is good for our scouting uh, boats that I'm going to make. Do -do. I also need the field hospital. Oh, let's get the radar first. Let's focus more on our navy. That's the whole thing about this run, right? More navy. Yeah, I don't think we can. Well... Can we win? Amelia Earhart disappears. Oh no, not Amelia Earhart. It's weird how this works. I'm telling them to attack. But they are not attacking. No, they are, but... And this tank is not even over here. I was waiting here for his... His bonus. He was sitting in Bilbao. Now I'm attacking in a hill in a city. Which is terrible for tanks. Can I also send planes? I don't know. If that is possible. I cannot click on their... No, I, I, I don't know. I think I cannot, but I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Okay, these uh, garrisons are getting made. That's good. Need a lot of them. Yeah, this not working. Uh, let's stop this order. Uh, this is also a hill, I guess. Yeah, there's all hills over here. Uh, let's give it a try, actually. Oh, uh, let's go here. Then we will get another pocket. Yeah, your supply is so low. This is the only thing you need to do. Acclimatization? What is that? I don't know. <laughs> I'm seeing all new things. Yeah, we will just train these boats when uh, we have a bit more fuel. At the moment we have not enough fuel, actually. I could put a civilian factory on uh, getting fuel, but... Hmm. 
Not sure if I should do that, actually. Yeah, there we go. There is the uh, Defense Council of Aragon. Over here. Which hopefully helps us fight against the, uh, the Republicans, right? Republican Spain. And I'm a bit scared here that we are gonna, going to get um, pocketed over here in this province. So maybe I should really run to Bilbao right now. I cannot lose my tanks. Look at this, they are at level 4 already. So they have a nice bonus. Looks like we are winning here. Not the best province to win. But uh, let's see what we can do here. Okay, there's the military police. I'm gonna put on our cavalry. Uh, let's get the field hospitals as well. We also need that one. Yeah, now we don't have the pocket anymore. I think I'm going to leave that spot and I'm going to go here because the, here are some planes. Especially over there. Maybe we can encircle them. Let's try that actually. It's going to take some time before they are there so we can take a look around over here. Poland is doing a revanchism. Okay, he might form his faction. That's, that would be fantastic. I think we have to uh, do this path right now. Yeah, we have a 1.18 research boost. Let's get uh, our submarines a bit better here. Let's do it. Yeah, we can modify our government again. Uh, we still need our aircraft designer. It's going to be focused on naval bombers and fighters. But we don't really have to do that right now. We could get our tank designer right now, of course. I mean, at the moment we do a lot of soft attack, but will we keep that one? I should also get our... Uh, Oh, we need army innovations for this one. But we want Erwin Rommel, because he gives 15% uh, armor division attack and defense. We also have a Ferdinand Schöne. Schöne. Hmm. What do we have over here? Air superiority. Oh, that, those are uh, the Air Force, Navy. We have uh, more capital ship attack and armor. We will go for that one when we can. Doesn't really matter really what we pick now. We should just get the tank designer so we get all the bonuses. I think we go with Porsche in the end because we will make uh, big tank divisions and that get a bit more armor and heart attack. I think that's uh, great together with the um, um, maintenance companies. They will have enough reliability I think. And we will do it like this. I think that's the best thing to do. How many factories do we have now? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 31. That's okay. Our fleet is going to be made. So we have this, um, this Scharnhorst Mark II but we have in the queue. We will keep making them the whole time. This one, one of our best. Uh, what we still need to make is a spotter cruiser. And spotter cruisers will get the aircraft facilities. Because they give service detection and sub detection. The only thing of these things is uh, be a spotter and nothing else actually. Uh, they need a battery. We will not give them anything else. Except for some sonar. Which will increase more sub-detection. 
Well, I think we can only get one radar, right? Yeah. This one needs to become uh, something else than a radar. And I think we are working on that right now. We give them big engines and for the other things we don't give them anything. But they are quick. And they have a good scouting possibilities. Uh, but we need a bit more navy experience for that, so... Maybe we have to keep training. Uh, let's train these ones. The new ships, and then we put them in the right, uh, the right fleet. Are my tanks in position? No, it's taking a long time. I think because they are attacked at the moment. Okay, there's the Rijksautobahn. Uh, we cannot do this one because we don't have enough war support. Wow. We are so close. <laughs> I think we go with army innovations. And the treaty so we can get our medium tanks. Uh, I can also do the reassert medium claims. The, the eastern claims on Mabel. So we get Mabel in our possession. And then we could go to the Densical War when we have to. Mm. Or naval effort. You can also get naval experience from that one. Yeah. Three dockyards. There we go. All the boats that we made are now built. So what I think I'm going to do. This uh, Mark II heavy battleship that we made. I'm going to put another one in the queue. Like this. And then we also can make some more submarines. Um, we also need convoy escorts. Convoy escorts, you, you just pick the, the cheapest one. This one or this one. Can I compare them? No. A bit more range. They cost the same. No, they are a bit more. Uh, manpower 325, 250. A bit more reliability. But you have the same module. So I think I'm going to put this one. As our... I'm, I'm making the crabs. These are going to be convoy escorts only. And it's actually pretty easy. Uh, when your convoys are getting attacked, they sign out. Uh, they they send out a signal to you to your fleet. Van, we are getting raided by submarines. And with these ships around on convoy escort, the submarines that are on uh, attack only when it is uh, safe will not attack anymore because uh, your tier one destroyers have depth charges. It's only one. That will make them not raid your convoys. And that's the only job from this ship. They are not going to be in the battles. They just are there. As a wall. Uh, let's call them animals. Because why not? So. And we will keep building these until eternity. Yes. Do it like this. Now we need more naval experience and the radars for our scouting uh, fleet. Now, where are my tanks? Why does it take so long for you to get out of that province? Why are they not making use of the strategic deployment? Oh, they are. But these are not. These two. Maybe they need to get out of this province first. I don't know how that works. Let's see. They get to this province. It takes forever for them to move to one province. The United Kingdom dominates the Dutch trade negotiations. Yes, so we have to start putting points in there.
try to surround them over here and kill them off. There's some Soviet tank over here. Yikes. We can always do this. There's our logistics. 1937. We only need some rubber. I think I'm gonna keep going on down that tree as well. Now I put them on attack. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I will try to surround some of these troops and try to kill them. And the science divisions. Yes, we have our first uh, garrisons. We will make a new theater for them. They're gonna uh, uh, guard the coastline. Um, oops. And another oops. This is the garrisons. There you go. And for now you can just do this. Guard the coastline. And when more are done, you will join that one. You still need to do that one. There we go. More dockyards available. So we are making our uh, convoy escorts now. Uh, how long does it take for naval effort? It's almost there. Um, we also need more screening vessels. I guess I'm going to make a new one of here. Let's duplicate it. Uh, screening vessels, so they need light guns only. Or some torpedoes. But uh, most important is that they have the light battery. Uh, Anti-air, yeah, can be good actually. They don't need sonar at all. I mean, how much does it cost? It's not that much more, isn't it? So, uh, we will get a torpedo launcher, we will get you... Uh, Anti-submarine warfare can be good, actually. But I think I'm gonna make specialized anti-submarine ships. So... I guess another light battery here. And another one. Should we get one torpedo launcher? Now they already have one. I don't think we need more than that. I think I'm going to do it like this. Destroyer 2 screen. There you go. And there goes all our uh, naval experience. Yeah. Do it like this. And we will build you until the end of time as well. You are more important than these ones. There we go. What are we building right now? Yeah, one more dockyard and then we are building some civilian factories. Our war support is actually going down. And I need just a little bit more. So um, I guess we get more when we do these focuses. I mean, we can do Sudetaland, so I will actually do the Sudetaland thing. But maybe we have to attack the Czechoslovakians and then we have to wait a bit, I think. Because we also have to fight France that way. And France has the Marginaux line here with big uh, fortifications. Then we need to attack Belgium and the Netherlands to get into France. So If they say no, then we have to let them go for a little bit. We cannot go after them. Because our fleet is not ready. I 
Three civilian factories. Um, yeah. Let's keep building a couple more, actually. Need more naval dockyards. Are you all trained? Nope. Uh, you need to do automatic split off. Do we have army experience again? Now we do have some anti-tank, but I don't think that's enough to put them in the in the template. Oh no. We need so much more. We need the field hospitals over here. So I need to wait for the field hospitals. And my panzer, yeah, you can actually get uh, some upgrades. You have a motorized recon unit, but you also can get an armored recon unit. You lose a bit of reconnaissance, but you get a bit more soft attack. Uh, a bit more breakthrough can be nice, actually. But yeah, we don't have the tanks, so... Let's keep the motorized in right now. They do have support artillery. I'm still a fan of it for the light tanks. Logistics, what about that? Let's put them in right now. And then we will add some more tanks. Uh, I think I'm just gonna add more medium tanks to this template when we have them. Uh, okay, that was the naval effort, so we have a bit more naval experience. We can get four naval dockyards here. But uh, no, we will demand Sudetenland from the Czechoslovakians. And make sure we have a army on their border. Yeah, we do actually. I think I think they are going to uh, say no. Let's get um, 24 infantry units on the border with the Czechs. And you are over there and you are at the border with Switzerland. I think it's time to build our um, agency, the Abwehr. Let's start building on our spies. Yeah, let's get these in as well. It's still early, very early actually. And there are the Carlists. So these are the factions. You have uh, Nationalist Spain who is losing. It looks very grim for Nationals, Nationalist Spain, but we will try what we can do, uh, what we can over here. I mean, our tanks are amazing, but uh, not looking good. Yes, good. Let's try to do this and get a pocket over here. I will not give up. And these are veterans now. They have 75% combat modifier. Now, watch out that we are not getting... And you go back here. And these two are gonna go here. They will cross a river. 
Oh, wait, they still have a command. No, cancel your command. Stay. And help this one. Uh, help this one. Oh, we need to go here quickly. We need to hold that line. Yes, there we go. And now make a... Pocket over here and kill them. Select all of them, cancel, they will readjust. I will just tell them that they can attack here. Can you actually win already? Yes, two of them are there and two of my troops are here. Let's attack over there. Um, it's soon 38, but not there yet. We need our medium tanks soon. I still need this one as well. Soon to complete this. Yeah, we do have the 100% bonus, but that's a bit too early. Do some more of these things. Going to be very important as well. We don't have the bonus yet, so I'm not gonna research it. Let's get our artillery better, actually. We use them in our tank divisions as well. Okay, I think we will get our uh, pocket killed there. And Abwehr is, Abwehr is done. I think we will also form our crypto cryptology department. And that's going to be it for this episode. In the next episode, we will see what uh, the response is from the Czechoslovakians. Hopefully we can turn around this war. And um, yeah, maybe Poland will form his own faction. Poland first, what is that doing? Yeah, I think he's going to form his own faction. So it is uh, free land for us in Poland. It's very good to know. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and I hope to see you in the next part. Bye bye.